What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Jermaine 3G, banging on the banger. And as y'all can see, the room is looking kind of messy. You know what I'm saying? I'm organizing what I'm going to keep and what I'm not going to keep. But before I do that, I wanted to unbox this sneaker. It just came out, Yeezy 500 High. I haven't had a Yeezy 500 High since the first model came out. So I'm excited to see how they looking. And without further ado, let's get straight to it, man. Let's get it. All right, now like I said before, it's been a minute since I got a Yeezy 500. So, uh, yeah, we're about to see how they look. And I did get this pair early from GOAT. So shout out to GOAT with the fast shipping. I'm able to review these way earlier. And uh, yeah, put this box to the side. I got a few boxes now. I need to break down, but uh, yeah, so this is a big box as y'all can see. We got a size 11, it says top black, taupe for black. Now, it's saying how the box looking all around. Okay, let's open it up. So, first thing is we have a First set, pair of laces. So these are like brown laces. So like taupe brown laces. And uh, here we have the actual shoe. So this is how it's looking. <laughs> and uh, this is the affinity lace. So they brought that back. You know what I'm saying? That's how the 500 is looking. They're not looking bad at all whatsoever. The Yeezy 500 tote. As y'all can see, you got a size 11. You know what I'm saying? Got soft up here. At the bottom, got the 500. And I honestly miss having 500s. I might get another pair eventually soon. But uh, yeah, man. These looking real nice. I'm not gonna cut. I know they're real soft on her. You see the stitching? This is all leather, suede. And this material feels more like a rubber. So it got a lot of different materials. This mesh, all type of different materials. Y'all can see how it's looking. I know it's not gonna be that many reviews out there. So I'm gonna try to make this as detailed as possible. And it comes with a, uh, a wedding string for the sizing. It's also cycle, bro. You go to size tag. And then we got the affinity lace. So as y'all can see, we got the Adidas right here. Suede, leather, mesh. Again, the rope is a Fendi delay. Some people cut it off and just have regular shoestrings. Me personally, I keep the affinity lace, as y'all can see, stretched out and you don't gotta worry about tying the shoes, but I guess if it's, you know what I'm saying, you might wanna adjust it yourself. You would cut the shoestrings and make it tighter. But I mean, this looks real nice. Now I'm not gonna do an on foot for this review, but 500 to me personally fit true to size. So I always would get a size 11 and a half and it'll fit perfect, uh, but it depends on your feet. So it says non-marking, that always says that. And honestly, this black, it looks more of a like dark navy blue in person. It looks a little bit like that on camera as well. This is more of a black color and the top of this. But uh, yeah, let me show y'all the inside. As y'all can see, it says Adidas. Easy. I don't know what a flash not on, but let me grab a flashlight, y'all. That way I ain't gotta end this clip. I could just show y'all how it look. As y'all can see, it's Adidas and then Easy, the regular insole. The color of it is this. You know what I'm saying? So that's how it's pretty much looking. 
And uh Yeah, there's nothing really much else I would like to say about these, but I do wanna say these are one of the most slept on Yeezys. I wanna say 380s, but I think since 500s were already slept on, these are the most slept on. So let me know what y'all think in the comment section down below. Leave a like, comment, share, subscribe if you're new. And I'm out, bro. Gang, gang. All right, let me show y'all before I end this video. The flash on it. I don't know why I just had it zoomed out like that. But as y'all can see. And it looked better when I recorded it a little bit. But not really. But as y'all can see. Uh, it looks pretty nice. With the flash on it. So it has the flash all the way around. That's the only thing I like about these two, is that it was always reflective. And uh, you know, I like my reflective Yeezys. And then if I didn't show the inside, it looks better. But yeah, that's it for this video. If you guys enjoyed it, leave a like, comment, subscribe. And if you're new, let me know what y'all uh, recommend for me to unbox next. And, uh, yeah, man, this is, for, you know, I know some people might want to search these up and get a good review. So, I'm not trying them on, but sizing for these, I had these before. It's true to size, bro. I would personally go, if you were a 10 and a half, go for a 10 and a half. You know what I'm saying? If you were 11, go for a size 11. And if you got wide feet, you might want to get half size up. But for me personally, I have wide feet. And I will go true to size, so... Let me know what y'all think and how these will be. I think these top tier, most comfortable Yeezys, but it's all depending on your feet. So, but yeah, let me know would y'all cop these or drop them. I would cop if they were all black, but I probably would. Oh, I, I doubt I would cop these, but it's been a minute since I had some. But uh, yeah, that's it for this video, man. I'm out, gang, gang.